Now Buddy's after alligator gar, which is a big toothy creature that's not known as a great eating fish. But first, Buddy must dispatch the gar. Well, that did it. That takes a bite out of him. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna fry up some of this bar fish. I like to soak it in buttermilk or either egg and milk combination. Couldn't see wasting all that fluid, so one thing that I discovered about 30 years ago is you could take your french fries, mix it up in that, and you're going to put that in one third each flour, cornmeal, and breadcrumbs. Then to make it a little extra special, sprinkle some panko breadcrumbs in there. And let that coat those potatoes. It's going to make a battered fry that you're really going to like. I don't put any seasoning in any of this because I think the best thing to do with your seasoning is when it comes out of that oil hot, put that seasoning on there and then the oils from that seasoning and that salt's going to melt and it'll be all on the outside or whatever it is you just got through cooking instead of melting in that grease on your stove. By the way, you can make up a batch of these potatoes, put them on a cookie sheet, freeze them, put them in a plastic bag, pull it out. So. If you want some battered fries and uh, you're not making any garfish, it'll be ready to go.